Hey guys, Grant Davis here with GDI Insurance Agency. I'm gonna bring you in a little closer to my world and hopefully you can see this okay. This is really super important, heat illness, heat illness prevention. We've got a 25 page guide right here. I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of run through it a little bit with you. Uh, more, more than that, I'm gonna tell you a little story. Um, so I have every year clients that have employees that have heat illness problems. It's hot. I'm in the Central Valley of California, but it's hotter in some other places in other states too. It's hot. I have, I have, I have one client that I can, I can think of right now, and actually it was a friend of mine that worked there, and um, he got heat illness so badly his kidneys shut down. He almost lost his kidneys. He was in the hospital for two weeks because of heat illness. Another time I was around somebody that was having a heat stroke, literally stroking out, having a heat stroke. 911's called and stuck, but you know what? Um, I also was a Boy Scout and in the Army learned first aid and so knew what to do. And so right away, man, it's like, hey man, we're opening them up and we're, we're packing them with ice under the arms, in the groin, around his head, back, neck, all the major arteries got packed with ice while we're waiting for the ambulance to come. And um, he was fine, and I don't know that it saved his life, but I do know that it was the right thing to do. So do you know what the right thing to do is? Do you know how to even recognize, and I'm, I'm grabbing my mouth, that's why I'm turning my back on you, but if we look here real close, and, and forgive me, I'm not a, an audio video, video kind of guy, so that's as close as I'm gonna get you guys, I think. But if we look here, right here, Okay, this is 25 pages, right? And it gives you everything you need to know. I mean, we're gonna heat rash, heat cramps, heat exhaustion, um, heat stroke, really bad. Okay, that's really, really bad. Heat illness causes symptoms, treatments, and prevention. Uh, monitoring weather conditions, providing sufficient water, access to shade, work severity and duration, rest periods, acclimation methods and procedures, high heat procedures, clothing and personal protective equipment, emergency response procedures, very important, training, um, conclusion and appendix, but here it is, it's 25 pages, it's in Word, it's downloadable for you. Um, and let me show you this. This is the website right here. This is our website right here, GDI. And what does that say in big words? Free download, Guide to Heat Illness Prevention Plans, California, download here, click. You can go a little farther, click any one of these clickers right here that I'm hitting and you download this full 25 page heat prevention deal. So that, I'm in my home office, so that's my grandma's clock going off there. So, but you know, here it is, it's all right here. There's no reason not to download it. Here, here's the deal. We promise you, I promise you myself, I promise you, nobody's calling you. Nobody's going to call and say, hey, gee, we want to do your insurance, okay? It's, it's just not happening. That's not why we're doing this. So we're not calling, excuse me, I bumped my little camera there. So um, like I say, I'm an insurance broker, not an audio video guy. So you got to bear with me always. But anyway, GDI Insurance, free download. And by the way, once you hook up with this, what happens? All we're asking for is your name and your email address. And we're going to, yeah, we'll send you a couple of emails. But what they're going to be? Offers. They're going to be offers to our blog and information on OSHA compliance, on safety. Um, right now we're doing a series on construction. Everything from construction from A to Z on contractual transfers, insurance, how it attaches and such. You'll get invited. And, and you know what? Just delete the email if you don't like it. You know, you don't have to take it. But it's this kind of stuff. Also, we have a section on our website called Free Reports. There's everything from HR to OSHA to all kinds of stuff there. And it's all just free to download. And all that happens, you put your name and your email address. And that, yeah, that puts you on an email list, okay? Um, you can opt off, though. You can say, hey, I don't want any more emails. Or, you know what? For me, I have a couple of emails that I subscribe to. I, I like them. And it's stuff like this. If this is important to me, something to do with my business or my faith or my family or things that I'm interested in or my hobbies or whatever, I, I have a couple. You know, I just do, I keep a couple. This might be one you want to keep. You might actually want to subscribe to our blog too because our blog gives you some cool information just, just like this. This is an example. You know, here, this is blogged, by the way. I'm just showing you the web pages, but this is blogged. And it gives you some overview of what's going on. You could decide if you like it, and if you like it, you click there 
and you download it for free in Word so you can make it your own. And it's compliant, by the way. Oh, by the way, this is, this is California OSHA compliant heat illness training. This isn't just some, you know, us typing up some stuff, you know, it's just not, that's not what it is. This is better than that. So anyway, I hope, I hope you take advantage of it. It's really, th this, this is 25 pages that matters. It's getting hot. This matters to your employees. Every, matter of fact, I would go ahead and print this baby up and give it to every one of my employees and have a quick meeting with it and just say, hey, look, make sure you're paying attention. Because it talks about the buddy system. It talks about, hey, watching for somebody else. Because what happens, um, and I've, I've had this happen myself a couple of times, because I'm an idiot, I guess, because I know better than calling myself an idiot. But, um, well, just the other day, I was out in the backyard. You can tell my, my wife will call me an idiot all the time, because I was in the backyard, and guess what? I'm in the backyard, I was gonna do one little project and come in. It's 104 degrees and humid out there, man. It was it was hot, and um, you know I'm getting older. I just don't take the heat as well. Well, then I decided to do another project, another project. By the time I came in, I was dehydrated. I said, man, I'm dizzy. I had to sit down. My wife's like, you know, you idiot, you. <laughs> she, you know, she's nicer than that, but I mean, she's really nice to me. But she was like, oh man, give me Gatorade and this and that. And it took me a while to rehydrate. And you know, I didn't get sick, but it was like I was right on the edge. If I had to stay out there another half hour to an hour, I might have gotten really sick, you know? So, so this is good stuff for them to have. And by the way, if you're worried, because sometimes this stuff says, oh, and then call an attorney or some other BS like that. No, no, this isn't about this. This is about, hey, making sure that you're watching other people too. Make sure, hey, oh, that guy doesn't look like he's doing too good. He's sweating too much. He looks like he's too hot. Um, oh, this person over here looks like they need some help or I need some help. Hey, can you help me out? I'm having a little trouble here. It, it tells you how to ask for help. It tells you how to watch to help other people. And then it also tells them what to do. It tells them what to do. Hey, someone's overheated. Here's what you do. Here's how you start helping them. Why you get help. Here's what you do, right? So go ahead and download this. I promise you'll love it. Hey, sorry, I'm not an audio video guy. So I'm gonna reach up and turn you off. Hey, thanks a lot. I hope to, hope to hear from you.